a friend gave me this book from Warren Hansen when I was going through a major time of transition in my life so many years ago. And I read it every morning and every night. And it gave me the inspiration that got me through that tough patch and a few tough patches since then. And it continues to inspire me. So I want to share it with you at the start of this new year. And it's called Beginning Encouragement at the Start of Something New, written by Warren Hansen. This is the beginning. This is where it all will start. On the wings of some new spirit, with a beat of some new heart. Every morning brings, brings a promise. Every day has gifts to give. But today, right now, this minute, is when I begin to live. And the air that I am breathing is the breeze of what could be as I stand here looking out on all the things that could be me. And the road that goes before me, leading somewhere out of sight, is a brand new opportunity for me to get it right. This is the beginning. This is once upon a time. There are dragons to be vanquished. There are castle walls to climb. But this story isn't written yet. I'm only at page one. The adventure that's awaiting me has only just begun. There are mysteries and treasures. There are daring deeds to do. And if I speak the secret word, then all my wishes will come true. That magic word has powers that can make the heavens spin. But it really is no secret that the password is begin. Oh, the possibilities in this beginning I have made. I am ready, but reluctant. I'm excited, but afraid. Afraid that starting something new leaves something old behind. Afraid that what I seek is something I may never find. Or if I find it, that it won't be what I want at all. That what I've left behind is what I needed after all. Beginning can be bittersweet and hard to comprehend. It can mean that some sweet, precious part of life is at an end. And the heart can feel so hollow when it has to say goodbye that the start of that the thought of starting over is too hard to even try. But when I reach the end, when all my days are nearly through, I will not want to look back on all the things I didn't do, nor regret the joys and passions of the me that might have been if only I had found the simple courage to begin. So this is the beginning, my beginning, my rebirth. I awaken to the wonder of what I am really worth. It is a springtime for the spirit, and it's giving me a choice. So I choose to use this season as a reason to rejoice. I lift my voice in sweet thanksgiving, singing loud and not alone. A host of harmonies accompanies my song of the unknown. Loving friends and willing strangers with their voices joining in create a chorus of encouragement that begs me to begin. In the end, it's out there somewhere, farther than the heart can see, and the power that will take me there is here inside of me. Though there is no way I can know how many trials I'll endure, nor the joys that I may find, there is one thing I know for sure. This is the beginning. So although a new year is symbolic of new beginnings, we can begin anytime we want, whether you're listening to this on January 1st or January 15th, or July 7th, or October 29th, I wish you well in your new beginnings. <laughs>